Hazel spent all summer in bed. He used to read to her after helping father with his work. In his mind, he was like that name. And as long as he kept telling the story, she would not die. Can't believe it just got kidnapped. A little bit of health. Uh. You had me worried. Quite frankly, I'm not sure what to do with you. Great. I hold no grudge against you, Daniel. We are so very much the same, you and I. Did you really drink from the amnesia mixture? It does explain so much of your behavior. You never did finish what you said. Nice. You talked about redemption. How you would face the old shadow and save our work and me. I will grant you another chance to redeem yourself. You can wait here and stop the shadow. Thank you, Dread. Oh man, my hammer. Freud. Need to find another thing of meat. In my dreams. Whoa, what? Hey, Thunderbox. Is he like just attached to the thing? I guess he can't move. Oh well. Oh. And a wooden bucket. Let's see if the monster will eat it again. Okay. Reel it back in, see what we find. Full of water. Okay, good start. Amen. Damn it. I have a bucket of water. Wait a minute. Oh. Puzzle time. Where'd the bucket go? Nice. Oh, jeez. Okay. Good to know. Being chased. Come on. Ow. It's coming. Left, right. Okay, left it is. Uh, right. Right, always meant right. Right is always the way to go. When you're right, you're right. Did a box? No? Okay, cool. Don't think we need it. Okay, we might need it. Why is water red? Oh, what's coming? And it's pissed off. Is there another fish in here? I can't even turn these on. Why are these even here? Okay, we made it. GG. 
When Hazel turned 15, she had lived three years longer than Dr. Tate had foreseen. Her parents had given up from exhaustion and decided to have her committed for permanent treatment at Canterbury Hospice, but she was still alive as she had embraced them and wished them a grand adventure in Algeria. Oh look, hey, we're back. Oh god, what? My brain. Alexander became silent. He didn't know what to say. He could no longer recognize his friend sitting across the carriage. 18th of August, 1839. Tonight. We will unlock the power of the orb and ultimately banish the shadow hunting me. I feel it closing in on me and I fear for my life more than ever. Just outside Altstadt lies a small settlement a Zimmerman, a dairy farmer, lives with his wife and three children. visit was unexpected, and Alexander was able to strike the Zimmerman down without alerting the others. As he went to take care of the farmhands, I began to look for the children. We should have more than enough prisoners to finish the ritual now. The crying had stopped and he could hear a whisper coming from the cell. They were up to something and he would have to punish them. So what I'm inferring from this is that Alexander manipulated Daniel to commit atrocities. And Daniel just wanted to forget. So that's why he drank the amnesia potion. That makes sense. I think. Hey look, we're back here. This place is massively wrecked. Hey, tinderbox. the box spawn here weird okay oh jeez all right I guess if we ever find a bucket we have to go back there good to know What up the lights? I turned them on. Last time I was here. Hey, a barrel. Something over there. I'm missing something. Trembled, and I could hear the chancel collapse. The laboratory might be accessible 
Hey, this is open now. Sweet. Bone saw. Right, tonic first, gotcha. So now that this is different, maybe some items will spawn here. Be something up here, right? Oil, worth. Always keep an extra ten, just in case. That's my advice. Because this game gets very, very dark, and I prefer to see, my good friend. You understand? A snake. He had turned angry, but it was easy to see, take her insolence and make her the villain in the story, but she didn't deserve to die. Even he could see that. Who is he? Who are we referring to? Hopefully I don't get jumped this time. Ow! Ow! Can, can you not? Jeez. How the hell do you build a castle like this anyways? Ow, oh, okay, I just keep taking damage. So far, all is good. Is that this way? Is it I really thought he would have disappeared. Let's try that. Break the door down. Oh god. Oh, oh Jesus fucking crap! I was trying to lock him out! Head to the door, head to the door. She cried and struggled as he pulled at her arm. Her flowered Sunday dress ripped and she fell into the mud. My question is, will he still be there? Alexander saw that that evening had taken a toll on his friend's mind and barred him from the inner sanctum. He could no longer be trusted to be part of the ritual. Okay, cool. He's no longer there. Oof.
Ow. Let's just be certain that he's not even here. Oh, he didn't... He didn't even break down the door. escaped and I chased after her all the way upstairs. I hunted her down and what is her life worth? How many lives can I take before I surrender my own? Sure, I would kill a murderer to save an innocent, but to kill an innocent to save myself? A cold-blooded murderer. Alright, I think I'll take a break for now. I've been recording for an hour. So... I'll see you guys in the next recording session, which will be recording session three, four, three to four. Oh, well, see you then.